Hello reception. Here's my baby bear's backpack because I remembered that baby bear took his teddy with him, some yellow space boots, an apple and I spied on the floor. Some chocolate biscuits, so I've put those in his bag too. And I know your grown-up has told you all about your magic sentence. My turn. Put it in. Your turn. I wonder if you can shout it really loud so your grown-ups can hear. Oh, I bet you could. Let's write our sentence together and then you can go and have a turn. The first word in my sentence is put it in. Put. So I can start with a capital P. -p, 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 -p because it's the start of my sentence. P. O. T. P. O. I can hear O is next. P. O. T. T. -t down the tower. Across the tower. Put, put. Oh, what's my next word? Put it. Oh, let's remember my finger space. And my first sound in it is it, it, it. Down the insect's body and a dot for his head. It. Down the tower, across the tower. It, it. Oh, let me read my sentence from the start. Put it in. Ooh, my next word, in. And my first sound in, in, is it, it, it. Down the insect's body and a dot for his head. It, n. Down, I'll be up and over his net. And I know... My sentence is finished because it says put, put it, 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 in, in. So I can put a full stop. And remember when you do your sentence to remember your capital letters and your lovely finger spaces and your super full stops. I wonder if your grown-up can give you one, two, three, four smiley faces, just like me. Let's read it one last time before you write it. Put it in.